And a transgender bathroom controversy. High schoolers here at home are divided about who can use which facilities. And first, some PV high students protested biological male students using women's bathrooms. Then another group walked out of class in support of trans students' rights today. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper shows us how the school plans to address these concerns. In the bathrooms and the locker rooms, it's honestly uncomfortable because they will sit there or just stand there and watch. There have been two protests in two weeks on campus over allowing transgender students to use the bathroom and locker rooms of their identifying gender. It's a complex issue that's dividing some students at Pleasant Valley High School. If the girls are using the restroom, like, I would like to have my privacy. I would, I would not appreciate someone just standing there watching me. California law allows trans students to use the bathroom of their identifying gender. But for Pleasant Valley High junior Mariana Seta, she says her definition of being transgender requires a sex change. For me personally, it's like if a male is changing to a female, they would, they're going to have their bottom surgery or if they would like to have breasts, like I would be okay with it. I would consider them a transgender. The controversy sparked over an Instagram post from a club on campus. We don't have permission to air the photos, but it shows two girls with signs that say men don't belong in the women's restroom and do not silence women on our campus. It has more than 2,000 comments, many of them shaming the protesters. Pleasant Valley High senior Drew Barron says he feels disgusted that the school allowed students to protest this. It's a little gross that our school, you know, our principal and the administration even let that pass as a club because they did have to get approval to, you know, hold that protest. He says the members of the Turning Point USA club on campus are not advocating for anything good. They're, they're not really advocating for any change. They're really just spreading hate uh, and trying to turn people against each other. When speaking your mind turns into spreading hate and creating a dangerous, hostile environment for a marginalized group of people who already go through so much on the daily, it's, it, it shouldn't be allowed at a school that's supposed to make people feel safe and help learn. Pleasant Valley Principal Damon Whitaker wouldn't speak with me in person over some of these student concerns and what the school's policy is over a matter like this, but he did email this response. Stating they want all students to feel safe and comfortable on campus, and anyone who doesn't feel comfortable in the locker rooms can speak with staff about different options. I'm Lauren Cooper reporting in Chico with Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. One of the students told Action News Now they think all gender bathrooms could be a good solution to accommodate everybody.